First tip of the day that we have here is the fast point. Some of these tips may be familiar to some of you, uh, but hopefully at least a few of them will be new concepts. And definitely feel free to share this amongst um, coworkers and, and others, anyone using the software. First one here is the fast point. Uh, point and click creation. I'm gonna go ahead and jump into a model. We're gonna create some fast points here real quick. So fast point, just go ahead and show you. Under the feature point dialog box here, or feature point button icon, if I go ahead and click on that, right at the top here we have this fast point creation. It's right under the frequently used functionality. Now if I click on this, my point labels do show up here. Let me turn those off real quick. And we'll turn those off. All right, the labels are off. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to quickly create some points along this surface on the top. This is for when you don't have exact IJK and you want to create points very quickly. So I'm going to go ahead and do so. Going to make sure you're in the creation mode. Uh, I'm going to click on the part and the points here, got to make sure we show hide points. So now when I have this dialog, the fast point creation dialog box op open, when I go through and when I click, we have DCS weekend create center points, switch direction DCS points, and as I click I can add a prefix. I need to close the last dialog box here. So as soon as I click along the surface we can see points being created. Um, these points we are just to quickly create an abundance of points. So I go through here, I could add a prefix here within the dialog box. I can also add center points and it gives me a list of the points I've created. Uh, so it's a real quick way to create points uh, where IJK's uh, XYZ coordinates are not available and quickly here I'll make a dozen 20 points. So that's the first tip that we have here. Feel free to ask questions in the chat um, as they arise. So tip number one again, fast point. Point and click creation. Uh, we can create feature points, DCS points, and also when your U and V vectors do not align. Quick question, can you drag those and move those points? Uh, move those points and those current points. Mm -hmm. uh, you have the option if you use the point um, if you go through, click the feature point, select the point, select the feature, you could type in a, a U and V um, if you'd like, if you knew that information. Uh, you could also create your, just based off the point you've created, you could move it uh, based off some of the feature point parameters. Yeah, dragging only works during the creation process. After the fact, you need to use the U and V values, like Chris said. 